Hello, Miss Munica. Uh, my name is Brent, and uh, my YouTube Talking Craft. Um, I'm going to show you a few things you can do uh, with, you know. Or basically, I'm going to ans answer a few of your questions. Um, the first question that you had kind of in the beginning was farming. Um, you need the block next to the water, and uh, the water will reach as far as four blocks like this um, so it can go you know four blocks in every direction and you can even connect this to make like a, a box like this so it'll even reach this corner one right here and as you can see even though I'm stepping on it it's still uh, s you know still tilled um, so, uh, yeah, you can walk on it. Um, one thing I would recommend doing is putting a fence around it. What I usually do is uh, once I get all my land tilled, plant my seed. Or I, okay, so what I do is I put something above the water and then I put torches on it. And then I just line it with the fences like this. And um, one thing that you will probably like is something called fence gates. It's like a door, but it connects to the fences. So you can go in, do your business, leave, close it, and you're good. Another thing is uh, animals. Uh, you can create a pen for your animals. And then you can... Let's see. Uh, and then you just put uh, a couple cows in here, your favorite animal. And what you can do to get more is you just give them wheat. Now since I'm in creative, it's not taking my wheat. You can't feed both of them with one piece of wheat. Uh, then they make a little baby cow. So very cute and adorable. Um, and you can do that with any animal. Uh, sheep, cows, pigs, chickens. So you can have a bunch of Rufuses, a bunch of Henrys. Um, and uh, I'm going to show you what you can do with your lapis. Um, let's show you. Okay, so what you can do, this is like the best thing ever. You get a couple of sheep, you dye the sheep, and then right here you have unlimited blue wool. Um, you could do it with just a few sheep since they get their wool back. Um, you could just get some shears and shear them. And you know, you get their wool and then they eat and get more. But you can also do this. Come here, sheep. Come on. Come over here. Come on. Go over there. Go over there. Go over there. Go over there. Oh, there they go. So see, and then since they're blue sheep, they'll make a baby blue sheep. And you can do that with any color. Um, I th think you can also take some bone meal. And you can... Let's see. Let's get... Uh, let's get another sheep. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Here we go. Another sheep. Where is the sheep? Where is the sheep? Man, I should have kept that in my inventory. Here we go. And you can... I th think... You can dye, yeah, okay, so once it's dyed, you can dye it back, and you can dye it any color. Um, what was I, there was something else I was going to say. Um, 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 what was I going to say? I can't remember. Um, um, I was going to say something. What was I going to say? Um, 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 oh, you can you can plant other things than wheat. Uh, you can do, you know, you got wheat, uh, sugar canes. Which, by the way, to grow sugar cane, they can they have to be directly adjacent to water, like this, right next to it. They can't be diagonal from it. They have to be right next to it. So you could do this and plant them next to the water and grow them like that uh... with cactuses um... let me, let me find them uh... cactus 
they they just can't be next to anything they see I can't place it right there they can only be diagonal from other blocks and they have to be on sand um, which here's some sand so you put it on sand and you can't put it right next to another one see you can only put it diagonal or skip one so like that um, if you were to put something in the middle like say piece of stone it would pop all of them out not sure why but that's what it does um, uh, that's pretty much it I hope you found this helpful and uh, never stop playing Minecraft thanks